All right, well, this isn't where I wanted to end up, but that's where I am. Missed a uh, trail. All right, what up everybody? Travis here with Every Single Sunday, and this is not Southern California. A couple weeks ago, we uh, packed up the van, moved to Utah, got a job out here. We'll get into all that stuff some other time, but uh, today our friends from Dirt Bike TV are out here. Say what up to Jay. Hey Jay. And Spence and the rest of the family, and we are gonna get out and uh, experience what Utah has to offer here, so. Couple of Jay's project bikes here. And then since we're up in Utah, I needed a third bike. He stopped by Moto Experts, local shop here. All right, guys, so we are heading out from the car. Blazing some dusty desert single track right now. Not really sure what to expect for today. Hopefully we get into some technical stuff and out of the sand. All right, well, this isn't where I wanted to end up, but that's where I am. Missed a uh, trail. <clears throat> that line's a little better. <sighs> you all right though? Yeah, I had a pretty good tumble, <sighs> but <sighs> no, not at all. Just not being on the bike in three months and not having the balls to twist the throttle and go across. <sighs> that was dumb. All right, so since the last video, if you guys have been following along with my life and riding and all that stuff, I have not been on the bike in, let's see, I've been on the bike one time in the last three months, and that's because I had a third surgery. I had all the screws and plates taken out of my ankle. It was just giving me problems. It was constantly swollen. It's been pretty much a year and a half since my surgery. And yeah, just still having issues. I had a lot of tendon and ligament damage I'm still trying to get over, but at least with all these screws out of here. Um, it doesn't hurt every time I step down and I don't have screws sticking out rubbing. Sorry, I got off the trail for a second here. Have screws rubbing on my skin, rubbing on my boots, and all that nasty stuff. Love these bottles because they're tall, skinny, they fit along all the other stuff in your pack. So they make one liter and one and a half liter versions. Well, it works with two strokes, four strokes, high elevation, low elevation, high compression head, low compression head, and all that stuff. You can work in the radiator or the, or the fuel tank because it's it can. smart so it knows what to do. It is. Okay, very good. All right, Spence, I see you got the vitamin water. So does that is that better than smart water? It tastes better than smart water because it's flavored. All right, so back on the trail, uh, got lost for a second there. Um, not showing you too much of that, obviously, for reasons. Um, but now we're gonna spread out a little bit and uh, see where this goes. So let's see where this goes. All right, this is kind of cool through here. Uh, loops all the way back on us, nice.
Some fun stuff out here. Love me some rocks. Big old slabs. Little white paint on the rocks so you know where to go. All right, still playing around on this rocky single track trail. Some fun stuff. Came through a little techie spot a minute ago, but couldn't get my hand up to turn the camera on, unfortunately. But it was cool. Have to take my word for it. trails like this all the square edge rocks and stuff this is the trail where I really love running moose in my tires instead of air it's the kind of stuff you just hit something just a little too hard to get that pinch flat so I run uh, nitro moose in my bikes and uh, I run the Platinum, which is the firm one in the front. And... This type of riding, you can get away with either in the back. If you're more of a fast guy, do the Platinum in the back. If you're gonna run some techie stuff, play on the rocks. Go with the Plushy, which is their soft version. So I'm running Platinum in the front and Plushy in the back. That's pretty much my go-to unless I'm up in like Baja or something. Tons of fast stuff that I'll do uh, plushy front and rear, or sorry. Uh, uh, and then I'll do a platinum front and rear. Oh yeah, a little chunky through there, I like it. Utah single track. So, like I said, I got a new job up here in Utah. That's why I moved out here. Pretty stoked on it. I'm having a lot of fun. It's a cool company. And uh, yeah, just some new stuff to ride now, new people to ride with. So this trail is supposed to be a little chunkier than what we've ridden today, so well, it sounds fun, I'm also excited. Yeah, this isn't the way.
gotten the loose stuff. All right, back on the trail. All these cows. Nope, stay over there, big cow. I don't want to fight you. Last one, man. Thank you. 